LPP Spolka Aksijna Lubianiak Pihotski and Partneje is a Polish retailing company based in Gdańsk whose brands include Reserved, Reserved Kids, Crop, House, Mojito and Sensei. It has a total of more than 1,700 stores located in 20 countries, mainly in Central and Eastern Europe. Besides Poland, stores are located in Belarus, Bulgaria, Croatia, the Czech Republic, Egypt, Estonia, Germany, Great Britain, Hungary, Kuwait, Latvia, Lithuania, Qatar, Romania, Russia, Saudi Arabia, Serbia, Slovakia, Ukraine and United Arab Emirates. Marek Pihotski has been president of the management board of LPP SA since 2015. Topic. Clothing Clothing is manufactured primarily in China, and to a lesser extent in India, Bangladesh and Poland. The design center for the reserved, crop and sensei brands is located in Gdansk, while the center for house and mojito is in Krakow. LPP owns the largest and most modern clothing distribution center in Central and Eastern Europe located in Prutschgdansky. Topic: <laughs> LPP clothing brands. Reserved the oldest, flagship brand of LPP, with the first stores opened in 1999 in Poland. Since 2002, reserved clothing has been available in the countries of Central and Eastern Europe, since 2014 also in Germany and Croatia, and since 2015 in the Middle East. The brand offers clothing for women, men and children. The latest models are delivered to the stores every day. Currently there are 461 reserved stores. Crop A youth brand, present on the market since 2004. Crop clothing is visible mainly in clubs, where young people want to manifest their unique style and independence. Clothing and accessories of crop can now be purchased in 379 stores. Hauselp The brand joined the portfolio of LPP in 2009, following the acquisition of Artman. House clothing is addressed to young people whose source of inspiration and an integral part of life is music. Currently there are 330 house stores. Mojito Like house, it is a part of LPP since 2009, following the acquisition of Artman. Mojito designers create collections addressed to women who are confident, love fashion and combine comfort with elegance. Currently, the brand's clothing can be purchased at 290 salons. Sensei Existing since 2012, the brand is addressed to young girls who follow the latest trends in fashion. The hallmark of Sensei are T-shirts with bold patterns and prints. Currently there are 198 Sensei stores. Shareholders Semper Simmel Foundation 31, 5% Sky Foundation 28, 6% Other 39, 8%
In 2018, the founders of the company, in order to ensure its long-term continuity and avoid the fragmentation of LPP's capital in the future, decided to create a foundation and to transfer their shares. Topic. Listing on the Warsaw Stock Exchange LPP SAW has been listed on the Warsaw Stock Exchange since 2001. At the debut, the price per share was 48 Polish Zlotys. In 2014, LPP entered the WIG20 index, which brings together the 20 largest companies listed on the Warsaw Stock Exchange. In the same year, LPP entered the MSCI index. In 2016, the average value of one share of LPP was over 5,000 Polish zlotys. Topic. Company history 1991 Marek Pihotsky and Jerzy Lubianiak establish Mistral, a company operating in the clothing industry. 1995 Mistral is transformed into LPP the name is an abbreviation of the names of the founders, Lubianiak, Pihotsky and Partners. 1997 Official opening of the LPP office in Shanghai. 1999 The first stores of the reserve brand are established in Poland. 2001 First listing of LPP shares on the Warsaw Stock Exchange 2002 Expansion of the reserved brand into Estonia, the Czech Republic, Russia, Hungary and Latvia 2003 Debut of reserved in Lithuania, Ukraine and Slovakia 2004 – The first store of the new crop brand is established in Poland 2005 – Crop clothing is available in Estonia, Slovakia and Latvia 2006 – Debut of crop in Russia, Lithuania and the Czech Republic 2007 – LPP starts operating on the Romanian market 2008 – Debut of LPP in Bulgaria 2008 – Commissioning of the LPP Distribution Center in Pruch Gdansk 2009 – Merger with Artman, the owner of the House and Mojito brands 2012 – Creation of the Sinsei brand 2013 opening of the first Sinsei stores 2014 LPP enters the WIG20 Stock Exchange Index 2014 LPP opens first reserved stores in Germany 2014 all brands of LPP debut in Croatia 2015 debut of LPP in the Middle East 2017 LPP opens its first flagship store on London's Oxford Street. Topic. Control of the supply chain LPP does not own any factories. The group's clothing brands are mainly manufactured in Asia, but also in Poland and other European countries. The company has an establishment in Shanghai since 1997. The office's employees are responsible, among other things, for finding suppliers, supporting various production stages and quality control. 
In 2015, LPP launched a representative office in the capital of Bangladesh, Dhaka. The office started its operations in May, and persons employed there are responsible for coordinating and supervising the production of collections in local factories. An important task of our employees is also auditing the production facilities with which the company cooperates in terms of appropriate working conditions and observing human rights. Topic: Disaster in Bangladesh. After the 2013 disaster at a clothing factory in Bangladesh, in which a building collapsed, killing 1,129 workers, crop town tags were found in the ruins of the factory. Representatives of the company said that they do not control working conditions in places where they have production. Topic. Agreement on the safe production LPP SA was the first Polish clothing company in Poland acceding to the agreement Accord on Fire and Building Safety in Bangladesh aimed at improving safety in factories producing garments in Bangladesh. It is a pioneering agreement for clothing companies, and international and local NGOs, to ensure sustainable improvement in safety and working conditions. The agreement consists of over 100 companies from the textile industry, mainly from Europe. For a five-year period there will be a series of remedial actions, ranging from independent monitoring of factories, and their modernization. During the program, LPP SAW undertook to pay membership fees, which will provide the opportunity to conduct inspections and training of up to $2.5 million and incur other costs related to the improvement of safety in the factories. Donation for the Rana Plaza victims and their families The company gave a voluntary donation to the victims and families of victims of the disaster at the factory Rana Plaza. <laughs> Code of Conduct Regardless of accession to the agreement, LPP SAW has committed to change its policy concerning cooperation with suppliers. The aim was to be able to exercise more effective control over the observance of its principles and the provisions of its internal code of conduct which the company issued and implemented in 2014. The document takes into account the key provisions of the ILO Conventions, the Universal Declaration of Human Rights as well as the recommendations of international civil society organizations monitoring working conditions in the garment industry. The code contains guidelines for all foreign suppliers of LPP. The document describes their obligations in terms of employment, such as Remuneration policies and formal requirements for employment Absolute ban on child labor and regulations on the employment of young workers Voluntary work Freedom of association Equal treatment of all employees regardless of their gender, age, disability, national origin, race, marital status, sexual orientation, political opinions, membership or not in organizations, religious or caste affiliation, health and safety standards, 
suppliers environmental responsibilities, verification of compliance with the provisions of the code is a key element of LPP control activities. LPP reserves the right to conduct an unannounced audit of all factories with which cooperated. Topic: Controversy over tax optimization. In January 2014, LPP saw's decision to move the brands to the subsidiaries in Cyprus and the United Arab Emirates sparked protests. Within days, 10,000 people joined a boycott page on Facebook initiated by young socialists to boycott products of LPP. Leaflets were planted in stores, accusing the company of tax evasion in Poland. The controversy caused the removal of the Facebook campaign page at the request of lawyers LPP, due to copyright infringement. In February 2015 the company launched a process aimed at the transfer of trademark rights to the Polish company LPP SAW. The reason for the liquidation of a company controlled by LPP in the United Arab Emirates, as well as the inclusion of the Cypriot company in Gdansk company LPP SAW, is change in the company's development strategy. In result, LPP SAW will become the sole owner of the trademark rights to Reserved, Crop, House, Mojito, Sensei and the know-how developed over the years. More than 90% of the profits generated by LPP SAW Capital Group will be taxed in Poland, in accordance with the provisions of the tax code, whereas the remaining part will be taxed in other countries in which operate showrooms of LPP. 